here's a nice group of registered purebred Brahmin heifers. The heifers are all raised on one ranch. Most of these heifers are, are V8 genetics uh, out of V bulls, V8 cows. Although not branded with V8, but they're like saying their mom and dad are both V8. Most of them. A few more Hudgens, but most of them are V8. Roughly, there's 19 head in the offering. I think there's like 12 that are three year olds that are coming threes, and then seven are two year olds. Bull has to expose. The three-year-olds should be calving pretty soon. We haven't palpated them, but knowing when the bull, the Her Horn Herbert bulls was exposed, I think this last, I think last June or something like that. So the, the Horn Herbert they should be having F1 calves pretty soon. Again, the ranch hadn't calved them yet. Again, there's a size difference. Some are a year older than the others, so there is obviously you'll see a size difference in this video. But there's twelve. There's nineteen here. Like twelve are coming threes and then seven are uh, coming two-year-olds nice group of heifers getting the genetics are stacked They're maybe not the most grass in the world in the, in the pasture they're grazing bits of middle of winter as you probably can see uh well, well actually not really middle of winter. <laughs> almost spring spring should be here it's, it's it's 35 this morning but in theory it's it's, it's almost springtime um the cattle are nice cattle are gentle as one i just jumped the middle of our video to kind of Scared of me, but the cow, I know the cow, they're, they're docile cattle. Again, they're all two and three year olds. For the most part, uh, V8 genetics. Uh, again, heifers this young, wow, I ought to give you, I mean, a good country, they should get 15 years out of these females. A nice group of registered Brahmins, well, again, we're outside of San Antonio, Texas, in this video. Uh, 12 of these heifers are coming threes, seven are coming twos, and we're exposed to horn herford bulls. Um, the sky's the limit on these girls. I mean, if I probably if I owned these cattle, I would go back and register Brahmin back on them because obviously you raise register stock. And, and if you're looking for Brahmin, there's not many registered cattle out there for sale, or not many Brahmins out there for sale these days, like the old days, you find them everywhere. But nowadays, there's not a hard Brahmins are hard to come by. This is your F1 factory, or if you're wanting to raise a registered purebred herd of these girls, you can do it. A nice group of stout heifers outside of San Antonio, Texas. I'm Clayton Hobbs. Give me a call to talk about these fine ladies in Stockdale, Texas. Have a good day.